and welcome to another Spectrum Geeks video. My name is Dale and thanks very much for joining me to talk about these special daily labs, kind of luxury car air fresheners. So it might seem like an odd thing to cover, so but daily labs are very kind to send me out a sample of these. This isn't a paid or sponsored review. They did send them these for free, but um, this video isn't kind of pre-vetted or anything. So this is my actual honest opinion on the products and what I think about them. So in the video, I'm gonna unbox a few of the ones that we have here, talk to you about the price, talk to you about kind of the different scents that are available, and kind of what I think of them, and then show you how you install them in the car and then kind of wrap up with my final thoughts. And there will be in this video information about how you can get 15% off any of your order of these daily labs, um, car scent dispensers and the scents themselves. And also I will do a giveaway of a couple of these to Spectrum Geeks members and there'll be more details on that later on in the video. So let's get on with it. So I don't know about you, typically when you think of car air fresheners, you think of something like this, maybe the Magic Tree, which is very, very popular, or ones I've seen quite recently, these Jelly Belly ones. They tend to hang from your rearview mirror. For me, it doesn't do much for my car aesthetic and they kind of are often overpoweringly stinky uh, don't last that long, maybe a couple of weeks, and it's just not something that I am interested in. So even though I'd never heard of them before, looking at these Daily Labs ones, um, they are premium, everything from the boxing to the products themselves. I've been trying them out for about three weeks now, so I can kind of give you an opinion on how well I think they work, and again, my opinion on the different scents. So we'll start off with the ones uh, that they've sent me, and then talk about the other ones that are available on the website. So here it is, amazing boxing, I think for uh, Air Fresh, and I think you agree. Uh, they can even come in a special gift bag. So if you have a, a car fanatic like me, and you're gonna give it to a, a loved one who is of a similar mind. I think they'd be really surprised to get this. I need to open it up and think it's not a piece of jewelry. It is actually a car air freshener. So this one is the Star Glow diffuser. You can see they all come in this box in this range and that is in the star glow colors i don't know how well that shows up on the camera just moving it around there it's kind of like a rainbow effect there is a pearl white one and uh, a space gray one as well which we'll look at those in a moment but basically this is again how they come boxed up you buy them online from the daily labs uh, web store and this particular one the star glow diffuser comes in two options one is a specific um, Tesla fitment, which if you have a Model 3 or a Model Y, it basically clips in with these little rubber mounts into the, the air vent, because it's a slightly different air vent in those Teslas, but it won't wobble and, and wiggle around and fall out when you push the go faster pedal. And then these ones, which they call their universal uh, mounts. For some reason, they are slightly more expensive, the universal mounts. They have this uh, rear protruding kind of gray attachment that's made out of rubber that basically just clips in to the air vent. So again, so it's nice and sturdy. This is the diffuser itself. So it's made out of a nice aluminium material. Feels like a premium product, definitely gonna last um, a while. And each of um, the products, again, at least in the um, Starglow diffuser, comes with two um, scents in the box and then you can buy obviously refills in different scents, depending on what you like. And the actual cover is uh, metal and it connects in with magnets. So I'll show you here. It just kind of pops off the front, like so. I need better nails. Just like this. And you can see the two magnets either side. You put your scent in there, which we'll look at those in a moment, and then this basically just clips back on. And again, in a little bit in the video, we'll show you out in the car how you Pop these in. I try them in a different couple of vents so that you can see. So that particular one, the Star Glow diffuser, like I've mentioned before, these are a premium product, so they are cheap, uh, more expensive uh, than the Magic Trees, but they do tend to last a little bit longer. So like I said, I've already been using these for three weeks, and the scent is still going strong. It's not overpowering. I reckon I easily get four, if not five weeks, out of a scent, and so starts to die off and obviously you want to have to replace it. So the universal one of the Star Glow diffuser is £87 and that includes, as I mentioned, two uh, of the 
scent refills. Those scent refills themselves are £20, so £10 each, uh, should you want to renew them. Or the Tesla um, model is £70. Again, slightly cheaper, not quite sure why they're not both the same price, but that's how it, how it is. So again, as you mentioned, this one is the Starglow diffuser in the Starglow colour, in those boxes that are very nice like this. Here is the pearl white one, which again looks very nice. Actually, if, if you've got a white um, upholstery, you might want to go with something like that. My personal preference would be um, the space grey one. Again, just like that. And again, they're all the same in this one, the universal fitment. And each of the measurements, those diffusers, there are nine different scents available. And we'll touch on that in a moment. And again, like I mentioned, I've they sent me samples of them all. I've been doing the old scratch and sniff so I'll let you know what I think about um, each of the scents. None of them are, are like disgusting, just I'll explain my order of preference and then that might make you or help you make a more informed purchasing decision as well. So then the next one that they've sent us to check out is the Aroma Stick. And again, that comes in an equally nice box. This nice grey box, green box, just like this. And instead of the silver one that kind of pops open, this one you kind of do the old shaky shaky, bit like an iPhone. You pop it open. And there we have inside the aroma sticks. So these particular aroma sticks are in the gold colour. There's also a space grey one which we'll show you in a moment. And again, these fit in similar uh, to those other ones, but again, you get two of them instead of the one. We just pop them out and you can see here it's a bit like a tie clip they will clip into the air vent so you can you'll either put one on each side of the kind of external air vents or perhaps the two in the middle just pop them for it there again we'll show you what they look like in terms of the mounting in there and how these uh inserts work the, the clues in the title i guess it is a stick and this kind of pops off the end and the scent just slides in to the end of there and then the kind of exhausty bits are on the back and again we'll show you installing that in just a moment okay and then this is the other color the space gray now the space gray personally would be my preference but again it's nice to have the options of the gray or the gold and now these are slightly cheaper than the star glow so the unit itself again if you're getting the tesla um option that's actually slightly more expensive this time uh, 75 pounds i believe it is again it comes um with the couple of refills in there or 60 pounds for the non-tesla unit and then you can buy refills for these it's 14 pounds for a pack of four and again available in all the nine cents so these are the two that uh, daily labs sent me to check out and again in a moment um, after we've spoke about the scents, I'll show you how easy it is to install them in the vehicle. And then again, we'll just do a, a quick driving test to show you they don't go flip-flopping all over the place. Um, but there are two other options as well that you can see if you check out their website. So they have the Aroma Planet, very similar kind of form factor to the Aroma Stick, but it's a small ball on the end. Uh, it's not the size of a ping pong ball, it's probably the size of a marble. Um, and again, that is only available in the universal fit and there's not a tesla specific one for that so it fits nicely in your air vent those are 53 pounds and you can buy the refills of those for 20 pounds for four of them and then the other one is something called the aroma 360 and that's really more just like um i guess i'd describe it as a button so instead of being a, a rounded one like the planet the, the, the 360 is just um kind of a round button uh, on the end of a similar clip again to those sticks they are £35, so the cheapest one out of all the Daily Labs offerings, and they are £14 for two of the refills. And again, all of the nine cents uh, are available for those. And again, they all have a very similar longevity in terms of the scent. Again, the main thing you're paying for up front is this nice cast aluminium um, diffuser that then you just buy the refills in over time. And I'm pretty sure it's going to last uh, the lifetime of multiple vehicles, it seems to be. A pretty sturdy product shipping from daily labs is typically around one to two weeks because uh, they are shipping from abroad and if your order is over 40 pounds 
then you will get free shipping. And uh, if your shipping is under 40 pounds, then it's about nine pounds, I think it is for shipping. And remember, if you use um, the Spectrum Geeks code, which is just down below, you can get 15% off your orders. I don't think that's just the first order. I think Day Labs have been kind enough to say every time you, know, you make an order, you can get um, that 15% off. And my preference would be if you can use the uh, affiliate link so that they know that um, you saw this with me at Spectrum Geeks to kind of help encourage other people to want to kind of share products that we can discuss here on the channel. So before we uh, look at installing, as I mentioned, they've sent me all of their scents available. There's nine available. So they have a citrus and tea, uh, a, a petty grain and cedar, uh, a grapefruit one, a sandalwood, an asphalt and vetiva, I think it's called, a grass one, and a Shenzhen 1979. So they're like the nine that's been kind of sent available to me. And again, are the scents that are available. When you're ordering the diffuser itself, you can choose what scents come in it. Uh, and obviously then when you want to just re replace the scents, you just click on the shop and just order the specific scent that you want. So I will tell you um, what are my favorite out of the nine in a descending order. Like I mentioned earlier, I think they all smell pretty good. Um, none of them are kind of, oh wow, you're stinking my car out. So I think you'd probably be happy with most. And obviously scent, like taste, is very kind of individual. So, you know, this is just my fault. So my favorite one, I think it's this one, the amber and pink pepper. It's a very kind of, it's not even a, it, I guess it is a slightly sweet smell, but it, it just smells very kind of clean and, and natural. So that is my favorite one out of all of the nine scents. Then my next favorite three, in no particular order, are this, the, the Petit Grain and Cedar, which is this one. And again, it, I, I guess it, it does smell a bit woody, um, perhaps with the cedar, but again, just a nice, fresh smell. So very, kind of pleasing to my scent. Actually, the next four actually are yeah, probably okay for me. Then the grapefruit, again, smells like grapefruit, but very subtle, not overpowering, like someone just blasted a grapefruit kind of aerosol into your car. Very nice, very pleasant. So um, that'd be the third one. The next one that I really like actually, and almost was my favorite one until I um, smelt that amber and pink uh, pepper one, is this one, the Champagne Rose. It's a very nice kind of, again, they're all just very simple, but nice scents, nothing overpowering. They're very pleasurable. And then citrus and tea. So they're my top five. And then these ones, again, they are all fine, just not really to my take. And so the grass one, again, it's, it, it does smell like grass, but not the kind of super nice, freshly cut grass smell that I was familiar with. There is a hint of that, but again, it's just kind of like, mm, okay, smells a bit grassy. So that'd be um, one to consider as well. Next one is the uh, sandalwood. So again, this one doesn't smell as nice for me as the um, one, the cedar wood one, but again, just, just pleasant, not overpowering, but at the same time, kind of, yeah, you know, not on my favourite list. Next fault, next one is this asphalt and vetiva. And I've got to be honest with you, I can't quite describe this smell, uh, and I'm not quite sure what, what I was expecting with the the asphalt piece. But again, maybe it's the colour thing as well. It reminds me very slightly of those violet um, sweets that you can get. Again, not unpleasant, just not in my top. And then the final one is this uh, Shenzhen 1979. That one is, for me, the strongest smelling of all of them. And perhaps that's why it's down the bottom of my list. It, it's a little bit more pungent uh, than the rest of them and not to kind of my life. I wouldn't be unhappy to have it in the car, but it isn't the one that I would choose um, to kind of replace. So if you do get um, one of these daily lab uh, diffusers and air fresheners please let me know in the comments what you think of them and what is your favorite so i'd be interested 
to hear from you. So that's my favorite in kind of somewhat descending order. Now let's pop out to the cars and I can show you how the um, scents fit into the diffusers and then how we basically plug them in onto the air vent. It's, it's very, very simple. Okay, so installing a diffuser in the Amber Glow diffuser is super straightforward. So you just need to pick up the diffuser, pushing gently at the bottom, just gently push it up, and that allows the magnets to come off, or at least stop holding the cover there. So just put that to one side. So here we have the diffuser, and then we get basically one of the scents here. This one here is the Amber and Pink Pepper, just labelled just down there and it's obviously foil packed these actually keep fresh for up to three years so if you want to bulk up on some it's not a problem i just need to peel this off this is the heart of it just like this taking that beautiful scent And then personally, I'm going to try not to touch it too much. I just get the back of the diffuser holder here, just hover it behind, and then it just pops in just like that. Super simple. Get the front plate again, stick it on with the magnet, and that's it. Again, shake it around. It's not doing anything. So the sensor's going to be released out of the back there perfect okay so installing this sense in the aroma stick diffuser is super simple obviously these come in a pack of two and in the box you get the nice little fragrance in there and it comes with the two sealed um scents obviously you're only going to use one of them because each one of these has the two sticks in there so you can just open the foil you see the two scent sticks inside just like that and then basically you get the stick diffuser here just simply pop it off it's magnetized and you get one of the sticks and again i just try to minimize touching it so my hand doesn't get the scent all over it pop that in Click back on and it's done, ready to be installed in the vehicle. So in terms of installing the air freshener, all of them are really easy to use. As you saw in previous videos, there's a little just a, a rubber piece on the back here. And it simply just slides straight on to the air vent itself. And because it's rubber, it's not gonna scratch or scruff anything. It can easily be removed. Again, center vents or even the side vents and the stick one, again, it's also just as easy. And you can see here, there is like a little plastic rubbery coating on the clips again. So again, when you're installing it, it creates absolutely no issue, no damage to the air vent. Obviously, for installing and removing, ensuring the vents are damage free. Now with both vents having one of the air fresheners in, we take it for a quick drive to show you a quick acceleration test to show you that they don't move at all. So my final thoughts on these Daily Lab air freshers, I really like them. Yes, they are Honestly, on the expensive side, I won't deny that, but I do think they're good. And like I said before, they're not some gimmicky thing that's hanging from the VV mirror and I actually do like um, the smell of them. Typically, I haven't been somebody that has the air fresheners in the car, I just kind of squirt something into the carpet and kind of let that kind of just settle gently and not be too overpowering. But I really like these. And I think actually the Aroma Sticks are my favorite one personally. But again, depending on your style and your car and the preference, you know, hopefully I think there's something for everybody. As mentioned, use the discount code um, 
spectrum to save 15% off your orders. There'll be that information down in the description. If you are a member, leave a comment um, down below with the hashtag daily labs and I will do a members only video where we use one of those random selectory things uh, in about a week's time. So probably middle, let's call it middle of July, 2023. And I will give away um, a couple of these daily labs, um, air diffusers and some of the scents to you as members to say thank you for supporting the channel. So hope this video was helpful. Perhaps you never thought you were going to look at um, something about car air fresheners, but you're glad you did. Thanks very much for watching. Ask any questions, leave any feedback down in the comments. Take care of yourself and tell the next video. Goodbye for now.